Hey there, everybody. Talk about a great gift. These two sons each gave their mom an organ to save her life. Today, we were there as they came back to say thank you to the transplant team that made it all happen. It's the whole crew now, guys. And what a reunion. The last time the Knott family met this team at Ohio's University of Cincinnati Medical Center, mom, Lynette Knott, was first in liver transplant surgery and then in kidney transplant surgery. The medical center provided this video. On Monday, we did the liver transplant. And then on Thursday, three days later, we did the kidney transplant. This is a different way thinking outside of the box a little bit. Dr. Cutler Quillen and Dr. Madison Cuffey told me to date, there are only 16 known operations, such as the one they performed on Lynette. I'm so glad to still be here. <laughs> Mark gave a piece of his liver as a living organ donor. She had mentioned to us like, hey, this is an option. Without a doubt, we're like, where do we start? Matt followed as a living kidney donor. Does Mother's Day weekend, what do I say to your mom? That I love you and I'd do it again. Mom was in the hospital five months and there were some complications. She developed a life-threatening bleed related to an infection around her kidney. And we had to remove the kidney in order to save her life. Uh, we flushed it, we preserved it, we stopped the bleeding and we put the kidney back in. Lynette missed a few milestones along the way, such as this family wedding she watched online where the two boys showed off their transplant scars. But if a picture is worth a thousand words, this Mother's Day weekend, the Knott family, John and Lynette, are grateful to hear the one word that matters most, mom. I do think it's a miracle. And I'm blessed. We're all blessed. Oh, yes. <laughs> yes, we are. To be an organ donor, living or deceased, you can sign up online. Be sure to tell your family your wishes. With your health news, I'm Liz Bonus reporting.